Hi, I'm Marlin, and I'm here to propose that we need to improve the description of authorship roles in modern collaborative computational sciences. Uh, I come to this issue from a scientific community manager angle, from the observation that strategic community management is very important for modern collaborative research to work, even so more in collaborative scientific tool development. But community management is one of those glue jobs that is often unrecognized, hard to describe and mostly invisible to outsiders. I also come to this issue as a computational scientist and research software engineer trying to help my peers, but frustrated by historic and current lack of recognition and funding for the computational tool developers and gaps and lacks in how coding contributions are reported and attributed. This is timely because if they weren't already all different sciences are currently in the process of becoming computational data sciences. Since research has very particular and rapidly changing demands and opportunities, every scientific field increasingly needs and depends on its software tool developers. And to retain tool developers, they need to give them proper credit, rec proper recognition, because attribution is important in science. It's a proper, for proper reporting for careers for funding, but we haven't quite solved attribution yet because author ordering, which we still use as a sort of primary mechanism, it's literally one dimensional. It's a pretty bad proxy for reporting how a group of people contributed in various dimensions to a research project. A scientific contributor role taxonomy, that is a scheme of classification of roles, is called CREDIT. This was launched in 2017 by a consortium called CASRAI, which is concerned with advancing standards and research admin information. The credit taxonomy is useful to have, as all standards are, but it groups all code-related contributor roles into one simply called software. That's not sufficient resolution for computation heavy sciences, I would say. There are several complementing efforts like data credit, which I just found, for the, which is specifically for data publishing roles. And two years ago, there was a team of software developers at the French National Institute for Research in Computer Science and Automation, INRIA. They proposed a proposed list of roles in software development. Combining credit and that list would be a solution partially, and this is definitely an improvement, but it still leaves out several important aspects not directly involved in scientific publishing, still important, such as outreach, teaching, mentoring, finding, and engaging and retaining tool users and contributors. And research roles in computational sciences have changed a lot in the last 10 to 15 years. GitHub has been a game changer, and collaborative scientific software development is no sort of a norm for how to do this. And these modern tool projects have a myriad of roles, all are needed. And I've put the, the bids contributors as an example on my slide. And they are standardizing uh, neuroimaging data set structure and developing tools and engaging people in using the standard. So as an initial step, I suggest an interest or working group for people interested in modernizing attributions. And the aim will be to collaborate on the combined crowdsource taxonomy that uses and extends existing efforts and includes a wider range of contributors, including scientific contexts that are not directly related to publishing.